that versus me in, in the nether. <laughs> <laughs> Somewhere in the span of time. No fluxes. Oh. Uh, a, a controversial man. That's but right. in a good way. In a good way, yeah. A very, a very uh, emphatic individual. Mm, yeah, that's right. Some would say. Brings a lot of hype yeah. to whatever he does. Um, known for his lifting and Ganondorf. And that's that, fair. And that's it. <laughs> I mean, that, those are two good things to be known for. Yeah. Those are solid things to be known for. Um, Ganon, uh, Falco, pretty bad for Ganon, but, you know, when it comes to, like, skill differential, most matchups in Melee are doable. Unless you're playing, like, one of the worst characters in the game. Like, Ganon you can, is tough. You can do Ganon, Falco. Um, it's tough. Who do you think is Ganon's worst matchup? I'll tell you mine after you tell me yours. Okay. Wait, let me think about the top tiers. Um. Okay, yeah. Three, two, one. Falcon. Fox. Oh. I think Falcon is definitely up there. Yeah. I think it's Fox, Falcon, and then Sheik, Falco, or those four characters really. Yeah. It feels like it's I, tough. I have a really weird. I think Falco candidate. might be the worst, actually. Fal Falco's kind of bad. The only reason I don't think Falco's as bad as, like, Fox. He just dies. Yeah. He Falco just dies just off dies. a hit. Yeah. You just die. If you yeah. get one solid read, Falco is the easiest to kill of the ones yeah. we mentioned. Falcon is definitely really good versus yeah. Ganon. I would say Fox is either hardest or second hardest yeah. right next to Falcon. Yeah. But, like, Sheik, I don't mind as Ganon because Ganon just chain grab Sheik. Yeah. Like, chain grab Sheik close to death, maybe even death. Yeah. Uh, which I think, I think Sheik is like the fourth. Uh, after the three we mentioned, it'd probably be Sheik yeah. being one of the, um, if I had to guess. But Falco can shut down Ganon. Um, the just, lasers. Like, shoot lasers. Ganon's going to be doing like a lot of pull hops to like avoid the Falco laser vortex stuff. Woo! A lot of platform movement. Oh yeah. my god. Whoa. And something that's fun as Ganon is uh, like, when you go up with Ganon up there, you're not going to trade. Or you're not gonna lose to most things. You'll trade at worst, right. but like you can just go up and up air to most characters. Uh, so like Falco down air can can get like beaten or traded with by uh, getting up air, which right. is like a very nice position to be in. Oh no! The movement from no fluxes is definitely what you need against one of the, the top tiers because you need to be able to at least close the distance at a semi reasonably fast pace. Yeah. Like wave landing and jab is always really nice. Going off the platforms and like sneaking in forward airs are always really nice. Yeah. Falco finally on the board. I think the control style of what, uh, as you mentioned, like Falco can control. We're not seeing too much of that from Falco. No flexes movements actually. The movement's good. Oh my god. It's preventing like some of the laser game that Falco might be wanting to do. Oh, tries to get the shield poke. Oh, oh no. no. Oh, following on the platform. Oh wow. Dang. Stylish. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Similar to Falcon style, you just stop one flat. Hard to deal with. Uh, Especially when the shield is a little bit low. It feels like Ganon can shield poke a oh, bit yeah, better yeah. with the stomp. Kage did that a lot uh, with the shield poke stomp. Way, way, much better with uh, with Ganon than Falcon, I would say. I feel like the Ganon punish game wasn't looking that bad, too. Like, we normally think of Ganon as like a straight hit character, but no Fluxus was getting like one, two, three hits, maybe. Like, Even getting like a two piece with Ganon is huge. Yeah, that's like 40 damage. <laughs> like, stomp forward air is <laughs> disgusting. Oh my god. Back here in the middle of the stage at 50. He died. Falco's dead. Yeah, that's <laughs> definitely the plight of Falco. Yeah. Oh! oh there you yeah. go, answer it back. That's good. <laughs> oh, had actually the tech chase, but got stuck in the, the dash dance a little bit. Oh, just jab. Okay, oh. missing the shield up top there, probably. I would agree, I would agree. Yeah. Edge canceling is also really nice as Ganon. Anything you can do to... Oh, God, I think... God. Just dead. <laughs> yeah, another back here at 50. Yeah. <laughs> that's why we're hesitant to put, like, Falco at the, the yeah. worst worst matchup for Ganon, because that stuff doesn't quite happen to Fox. Even Falcon. Ooh, tries to get the tech roll read in. Okay, there you go. Nice, good I, coverage, good yeah. coverage. I like that weight too, just like, just in case no fluxes drifted more to edge, which it looks like he tried. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, just covered everything. That's what you want to do to edge guard Ganon and Falcon too. 
just like holding edge and then waiting for him to come on stage. Oh. Oh. That was nice. Uh, bang. Yeah, you could grab that. Oh. <laughs> Get a jab. It's like, it's good if you think they're gonna press a button out of shield, but if they're holding shield, you just you just punish it. Right. Just grab or something. Oh, oh my God! Wow. Slipping and sliding. It's like, oh, dude! All the Ganons have like the longest wave dashes and the longest like wave lands. It's like a prerequisite to being good at as Ganon. <laughs> when I was playing Ganon, I just had like a really stuck <laughs> wave dash. Like you can tell, I don't play Ganon. Oh, oh, nice! Just keeping it like simple. Keeping it simple. Yeah, nice up air coverage uh, for the ledge. Yeah. 2-0. 2-0. Like, Solid 2-0. Yeah. Yeah. Um, it felt like the Falco was coming back. Just a little bit more time, and I feel like we could have seen a, a much closer set. Yeah. The thing about fighting Ganon with pretty much anyone is, like, I feel like you don't want to be scared. Because once you're scared and you give them that little bit of range to where, like, the forward air spacing is there, mm -hmm. that's where Ganon thrives. You want to be, like, super close, because Ganon also doesn't... It's not fast, right? So all the startup is really bad. So if you're right there... You can just stuff out like any like starting animation that Ganon wants right. to do. But once you're scared, then it's like, oh.